I am so grateful that we were able to play sports this fall because it allowed me the opportunity to work with this wonderful group of athletes. Although our season was short, I want to say thank you for your effort and positive attitudes each day. You truly understood the meaning of team. This was evident every day in practice, games, the few bus rides we had, and even more in the pink event you planned to show our support for the Jiraki family. As a coach during a pandemic, my goal was to not only start the season, but to finish it. Along the way, I wanted to improve skills and have fun. After our last ma match, I felt we had accomplished all three of those things. And lastly, I hope that you leave this season with a ton of pride in your school and this program that you are a part of. It's special, and I am thankful to have had the chance to coach you. Number one, Kia Strop. She is a freshman outside hitter. Kia's drive and focus really stood out this season. She took feedback well and was very coachable. Kia's teammates appreciated her energy and how encouraging she was. Her defense really improved throughout the season. She is quick and will give it her all to not let any ball drop. Number one, Kia Strop. Number two, Kinsley Alvarez. She's a junior defensive specialist. Kinsley's hustle and anticipation on the court really stands out. She is a consistent serve receive passer. Sometimes passing goes unnoticed, but without a pass, there is no offense, and Kinsley's definitely allowed us to run our offense. And that is why Kinsley was selected as the best defensive player this season. Kinsley's teammates appreciate the positivity and excitement she brings to the court. Number two, Kinsley Alvarez. Number three, Avery Amadon. She is a sophomore right side. Avery played all around for us this season. She has an aggressive hit from the right side and is also a consistent defensive player. Unfortunately, Avery's season ended early with an ankle injury, but that didn't stop Avery from coming to every practice and game. She found a way to contribute even though she couldn't be on the court. Avery's teammates appreciate her funny jokes, volleyball knowledge, and willingness to help everyone. Number three, Avery Amadon. Number four, Kendra Paschke. She is a junior right side. Kendra is another all-around player. She was always ready to take the second ball when needed, confident in her passing, and had a serve that was very hard to receive. Kendra brought a sense of calm to the team. Quote from her teammate, she adds a chill vibe to our team and reminds others to not be so uptight. Her teammates also appreciate her focus and cheerfulness. Number four, Kendra Paschke. Number five, Becca Randleman. She is a sophomore middle hitter. Becca is a returning JV player who earned more playing time this season by being more aggressive and confident in her skills. She is quiet, but makes her presence known on the court with her height, quickness, and ability to get on top of the ball when she hits. This is why Becca received the JV Best Offense Award. Becca's teammates appreciate her humble and hardworking nature, along with knowing they could always count on her to be ready to play to the best of her ability. Number five, Becca Randleman. Number six, Allie Lobby. She's a sophomore defensive specialist. One quality that stands out about Allie is how coachable she was. She took feedback very well and is always asking questions. She works hard to make changes. Over the course of the season, I saw her become more confident in her passing and defense. Allie never gives up going after a ball. Her defensive pursuit is one to admire. Allie's teammates appreciate her hustle and never give up attitude. Number six, Allie Lobby. Number seven, Hannah Jiraki. She is a freshman outside hitter turned into middle hitter for this JV season. Hannah took on the role without hesitation, even though she did not have prior experience to playing middle. Moving Hannah to the middle was an easy decision as she is very coachable, athletic, and a skilled volleyball player. She was able to adjust to the middle set and contribute to our offense. Unfortunately, Hannah had to miss a handful of practices due to quarantine. But with that, her teammates noticed her dedication and positivity. She always came back ready to play. Number seven, Hannah Jiraki. Number eight, Olivia Redman. She is a junior setter, team captain, and also recipient of this season's Wildcat Award. The Wildcat Award is given out to recognize Olivia's leadership, work ethic, and commitment. Olivia leads the team by working hard, having a positive attitude, encouraging, and helping her team when needed. Her teammates appreciate her beautiful and consistent sets, that she knows where they should be on the court at all times, and her goofiness brings fun to the team. They also call her the team mom. Number eight, Olivia Redman. Number nine, Laurel Benedict. She is a junior outside hitter and team captain. Laurel is a very skilled outside hitter. She has a wide variety of hits that makes her successful on offense. 
She knows when to use her aggressive hard hit or when to roll it over the block. Laurel's teammates trust her skills wherever she is on the court. They also appreciate how vocal she is and how excited she gets when the team does something good. Number 9, Laurel Benedict. Number 10, Erin Strub. She is a sophomore right side hitter. One quality I appreciate about Erin is how coachable she was. She took feedback very well and worked hard to improve. Over the course of the season, her passing and defense improved so much. She worked to stay on her feet and get to every ball like I know she can because of how quick and athletic she is. Erin's teammates appreciate her sense of humor, her giggly personality, and how hard she works. Number 10, Erin Strub. Number 11, Taylor Wozniak. She is a junior outside hitter. Taylor is a very well-rounded player. She is consistent at the net. She is very good at seeing the court and hitting the open spot. We could always count on Taylor and serve receive as well and to make great defensive plays. Taylor's teammates appreciate that she likes to have fun, but it's also very focused on the court. Number 11, Taylor Wozniak. Number 12, Josie Johnson. She is a junior outside hitter turned into middle hitter for this season. I appreciate Josie taking on the middle position this season. I knew she had experience, but also knew it wasn't her favorite place to play. She worked hard at the net and made her presence known, whether she was blocking or hitting. Josie's teammates appreciated her consistent energy, or as they call it, hype, this season, and that is why Josie receives the most improved award. She not only improved her skills, but was able to keep her emotions on the court balanced. Number 12, Josie Johnson.